All right, we're back with another craft. Since it's July, and July is the month we celebrate Independence Day, we're gonna do a flag-inspired craft. So your kit is gonna look like this, and this is what we're gonna make. We're gonna make a red, white, and blue headband. You're gonna have one big piece of blue paper, and then a piece of red paper, and white paper, and a star template, two red, and two white pipe cleaners. And I'm gonna need a pair of scissors, one second. Okay, got scissors. So, what you're gonna to wanna to do is to make the headband part, you're gonna take your blue paper, you're gonna cut it in half, like the long way like this, and then you're gonna cut it in half again, just one of those sides, so it looks like this, because that's gonna be what you use to measure your headband. I'm going to take and glue the two ends together. And then you're going to measure. You're going to take and you're going to measure this around your head. And you're going to glue it what, wherever it fits. You can make it smaller or you can make it bigger. And then you're going to glue it there. Now, if you want to wear it right away, you might want to use tape just so your hair doesn't get stuck in the glue. Or you can do just like this. So then you have a circle and you're gonna make sure that fits your head. Now, you can either draw your own stars or you can cut out the stars I gave you and then you can use them to trace stars on the red, white, and blue paper. Now I did notice as I was putting these kits together that the white paper I used is heavier than the blue. So it would be perfectly okay to use the white to make your headband instead of the blue if you like. After that, after you've got your stars all cut out like that, you're gonna take your pipe cleaners and you wanna cut these different lengths. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut one in half and then I'm gonna cut the other one in thirds so that we have different lengths on, our, on what we're putting our stars on. And I'm going to do the same thing with the red pipe cleaners. One just in half and one in thirds. There we go. Now, like I've said before, I like the I like this kind of glue when I'm using the pipe cleaners because the pipe cleaners are fuzzy and sometimes the other kind of glue doesn't really stick to it. So depending on how many, three, six, how many stars, you can put however many you want really. You can fill it all up with stars or you can just put a few, but we're gonna take and I don't know, let's see. Let's glue the stars onto the tips of the pipe cleaner first. You want to get them out there so it'll make sure it sticks. I'm sure we figured out before that that doesn't always stick very well. So let's do this. Like I said, however many you want, I'm going to put a bunch on here. Because there should be plenty of construction paper to make as many as you want. Some on small stars, some on big stars. Of 
course that glue always takes a little while to dry. Two, three, four, five, six. is taking a while. You don't have to use all your stars. All right. There, see? Got a little extra there, but that's okay. Now, you're going to take those that you got stuck on the stars and you're going to put them sticking up all over your headband. going to be a little tricky because you got to let it dry. So I'm going to do it like this, but you get the idea. So that's what your headband's going to look like. I hope you have fun. Happy 4th of July.